Hey everybody, it's Carolina, and this is Carolina is here. And the goal of this channel is to make sure everybody knows their rights, because it's our only weapon that we have against tyranny. Now do me a favor and hit that thumbs up, because I need this to get caught in the algorithm and so everybody can see it. And today we're talking about why the cops don't like you filming. One of the main reasons they don't like you to film is because it's, they think that it challenges their authority. They are not able to handle people talking back to them, people telling them what to do, people telling them what they can do. They're so used to people just complying all the time that they just don't know how to handle it. The second reason why they don't like people filming is because a lot of them consider themselves warriors or their friends are warriors and they don't want to be caught on some viral video going nationwide or even worldwide with some idiots acting like warriors. Let me give you some examples right now to show you what I'm talking about. You ask anybody that cop watches and they will tell you that for sure their camera changes the dynamics of the scene. When police see that camera, sometimes they will not give a ticket. Or maybe that person that they're messing with, he could have became unalive had it not been for your camera. Even though cops say you can film all you want to, we all know that they don't want us to. Right away they will test to see if you can be intimidated or not. Great citizen cannot be intimidated. Watch what he does to prove that fact to them. 1610. We're more than 10 feet away. No. You need nope, you're dismissed. Dismissed? Yep. Actually, that's not how it works, but. Am I committing a crime? No, but I'd like to know if you I'd something. like to not answer your questions. You're dismissed. Well, why are you taking it? Because I'm allowed to film in public. You are allowed to film in public. Cool. Public. You're dismissed. I'm just making sure that you need anything. I don't need anything from you. Okay. Well, just do us a favor. Don't interfere with our investigation. I'm not interfering. You don't need to tell me that. Appreciate you though. Cool. Okay? Yeah, yeah, for sure. You. You. I'm sorry, do I do I have a first amendment too, man? I, I you dude. I can I can say what I want. Exactly. Which means I can say fuck and point the camera at you. Yeah. Cool. You're dismissed. Yep, that's it. Bet you never been told that. I'm just sitting here filming, you're scared of a camera. And I wouldn't have been impolite if he had tried, if he hadn't tried to tell me how this works. But when you try to tell a citizen who's just minding his own business how this works, you're uh, giving a command that you don't need to give. And we'll hang around for a bit. It doesn't look like anybody's in trouble over here. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm not doing anything wrong, man. You can't just walk up on a I can absolutely. I know the law better than you, don't I? Interesting. I'm 10 feet away. I'm 10. You were close. What law am I breaking? I don't know you. Tell me what law I'm breaking, officer. Are you coming to let this dude out of the car? Can you tell me what law I'm breaking? Are you coming to let this dude out of the car? I don't have to answer your because questions. What it look like. I don't have to answer you your questions. Right up to that car. This is textbook, dude. I don't have to answer your questions. You're just educating my my, my friends here. That's all. You can educate all you want, but what you can't do is you can't interfere with our investigation. Okay. That's what I'm going to tell you. If you'd like to video, I would like you against the wall because I'm gonna let you know right now. Here's good. To right here. Here's fine. And this is where my prisoner is. You want to see him? Okay, here here's he is. Fine. There's a prisoner back. Are you okay? So it sure looked like you were coming to let him out of the car. You're getting a complaint on you, dude. You need you to step back. You go right ahead. I haven't violated I've been any of your rights. I haven't violated any of your laws. Once. But you sure are oh, man. really taking me away from my You sound like feelings enforcement right now. You're law feelings enforcement, dude. Enforcement? Yeah, you yeah. Walk up yeah. to a cruiser to maybe let. What law did I break? What law did I break? Dude. I'm just telling you right now, don't do that again or you will be detained. What law did I break? I'm telling you, do you understand? If what you law did I break? Cruiser, there are Educate the public. Educate the public. What law did I break? I don't know you. You don't know what law I broke. I don't Because there know wasn't you. one. So if you... Can you leave me alone? I'm just filming. Can you leave it's me alone? Obstruction. Can you it's leave me alone? Obstruction. It's not. It's it not. It's no, no, actually, it's, it's, it's 10 feet away, dude. It's 10 feet That's away. Cute. Because all I need is eight, and there's ten feet. feet. All I need is eight. I know well, the law, man. You know again, I know the law. Don't do it. You don't have to let me know anything. Don't do it. I can do what I was doing. I was ten feet away. You and you still can't name a law I broke. Can you, law enforcement? You can't name a law. You're real mad. You're big mad right now. Throwing your arms in the air. Yeah. 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 Obstruction. Say it again. Say it again. I'm still not under arrest, am I? Interesting. 
Because I'm telling you. That it because you don't have power over a law-abiding citizen. You're dismissed. Dismiss is something you haven't heard from a citizen. Congratulations, you heard it today. Your partner's smart. He's seen his car and he kept his mouth shut. I'm doing a great job. <laughs> hmm. I... Good. Can I get a badge number? Fine. Yeah. 680. A plus. A plus, my friend. Well done. Hey. All of that came from us. Okay. So, what I need next is price. So, how much this is. Yep. Yeah. 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 Depending on the price, it's going to be a mystery. Looks like a theft. Well, that guy went crazy fast, huh? Yeah, this is a theft, and depending on the price of the merchandise stolen, that determines whether it's a misdemeanor or a felony. We're going to look at another example, but as you can see, it's because they say you can film all you want to doesn't mean they really want you to. This is Social Informed Media, and he's a lawyer, and he actually knows a lot more law than what the cop does, and he establishes that fact right away. When you do that, the cop doesn't have a chance against you because they're looking for people that don't know their rights, because people that don't know their rights they can get over on. Right away, Social Informed Media establishes the fact that there's no way this guy's going to get over on him. Even so, cops are constantly looking for some sort of loophole to stop you from filming. Where's this cop going? <laughs> yeah, there's strange cops too. Beat people up, handcuffs. Yeah, cheeseburger and fries, please. Okay, well, this is private property, sir. Right, but it's not police property. So uh, when the owner calls you and says, I would like him to leave, then that's when you conduct well, actually, a trespass. I believe this is on a trespass agreement, so. Okay, well, I'll go over here by your car. How about that? Wonderful. Yeah, now get back in your car and do your job, okay? That's the agreement is we pay the taxes and you do the job. We are doing our job, sir. Don't walk up on me. I have every right to. This is no, you land. need to keep your space. Which I do if not. If I walk up on you, you'd handcuff me, right? I have every right to. Don't walk up on well, me. Step back under Look at him trying to intimidate me, guys. Intimidation is their go-to tool to try to make you stop filming. Just step back on the public sidewalk. This is a thoroughway for pedestrians. Well, then walk through, but right now we're I'm on not the traffic stop, through. sir. So go and step back, sir. Step oh, away right from here. the patrol vehicles. Thank you. Now get in your car. Uh, let's get away from the patrol vehicles. I'm allowed to record. Penal Code 148G says photography yeah. and videography alone cannot be deemed a suspicious activity. I did not. Yet you I call me a suspicious you. character in the field. Yes, and that's when there's going to be a female that's going to be outside. Okay, but 148G says videography cannot be a suspicious activity by itself. I never said that was. You did. You said, look at the strange person, which is another word of suspicious. No, so what you did basically was you violated you penal code 148G. If you read our police cards, and then when you walk up in my face like that, it could be construed as a Bain Act violation because you're using intimidation tactic to interfere with my First Amendment rights. So see, you're not messing with a guy who doesn't know the law. I'm a little more educated than you just might think. Should we go to jail for what you filmed earlier? We could do that if you would like. No, because the trespass law states if you say, come onto the sidewalk, 
and we leave, then that's it. We're no longer trespassing. See, now you're looking for a reason to arrest me because I'm recording you on camera. That's how it works, and that's the reason that I'm out here. Hold on a sir. Hold on a minute, Sergeant. That's the reason that I'm out here, is to record you guys to educate you on the fact that look, the camera is not your enemy. The camera can be your friend if you would like it to be. About that, you wouldn't be confrontational and challenging. I'm not confrontational. Because when you say we're not out here doing our job, you know what? I well, you're not right now. You're over here. I would appreciate upset with a guy cases. who's just not. trying to record the police because for accountability like purposes. And what you should be document, if you actually, that is your belief, is the understanding that a vehicle that was doing over twice the speed limit with somebody that's almost twice the legal limit to drive a motor vehicle is in custody today. Okay, and then you so say, oh, look at the strange a, camera. We have a female that we're going to leave. And if okay. you wanted to appropriately document, you would. If you wanted to be I am. You are. And no, you're the one that got you're the one that got out of the car, Sergeant. You're the one that walked over here. No, you that has nothing to do with the sign. You got mad because I said, yeah, strange cops punch people that are handcuffed. That upset you. I'm sorry it upset you, okay? Then why did you get out of the car and approach me when I because said it? That you didn't say that. You said strange people hang out in fields. You didn't get out of the car until I said strange cops punch people. Then you got out of the car because you were offended. I'm sorry you got offended, Sergeant. This is 831 Community Watch, and there's going to be a cop come from way over there to way over here to give some unlawful directives. When you're new, sometimes it's hard to judge how much of the unlawful directive you want to follow. You should definitely practice a little bit before you stand your ground. 831 knows exactly how far he can push back. All right, thank you. Hey man, I just told you, just, you gotta get a little farther back. You can keep recording. Dude, we're dealing with this. I'm, I'm not even saying nothing to you guys, man. I'm just standing here, bro. Put some tape up then. Then, then don't. Then just let me do my thing, bro. You guys do your thing. I'm not bothering you guys, man. That's the thing. I just told you. I'm, I'm standing. You understand. I'm standing. Yeah, you're about five feet away from this car that Dude. we're investigating. So back up, okay? I know what you're all about. Can, can, can you do something, please? I'm, I'm standing here, bro. Dude. Dude. Can I get your name, sir? Dude, it's Commander Viegas. Okay, what else thank you, want? you, sir. Back up. How much more do you want back me to back up? Because I'm just standing you need here, to back dude. Back up at least Where? to that pole. Is right that there. fine? Yep, yeah. that is fine. Okay. Yeah, How about that? Keep going. How no. about? I said that. Okay, that I'm done. Right I'm done. This is as far as I'm going, bro. Okay. I'm not doing anything, that's, that's dude. That's the person issue. You lucky we're dealing with other things? We'll deal with you later. Okay. <laughs> Boy, that's a lame attempt at intimidation. But watch how he struts away. This is too funny. <laughs> For recording, that's a threat or what? But I'll do it with you later because we know what you're all about. We've contacted you before. You've contacted me before, okay. You got a juvenile right here. And you understand that, right? And you're gonna and you're gonna record that, right? No, I'm recording your actions right now. But you're recording this entire thing. Okay. 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 I'll let her know because I know who you are. Okay. I'll give her your name. So then tell her who I am then. Tell her. Go ahead and tell her. All right. You can find this on YouTube, Frank Evans. How's that? There, I told her. How's that? Since they're going to tell you, you can film all you want to. That's what you should do because you never know whose life you may save. Always pick up a camera when you see a police interaction. Who knows? You might get the next viral video.